A A A. This is me, V, aka Bourgeois Latte, live in full effect in my, I guess you could say cafe bistro today, but right now I'm having a green smoothie and it's pretty good. Now, don't get me wrong, you know, I'm not ditching coffee, you know, coffee is my life, but today I needed something while well, I've been drinking it for the past three days. Sometimes your body needs a break, so I'm having having green smoothie, you know, to get rid of all those toxins that are in my body. And plus, you know, you know, sometimes it's good to take a little break and let your skin, you know, you know, get get glowy. And yeah, that's that's my main reason is. And plus, I have a very sensitive stomach, so sometimes I do need to take a break from um, coffee and. Um, potatoes you know even though I'm vegan sometimes your body just need a rest but I'll be back tomorrow drinking coffee I may have to drink just a little I don't know sometimes your body get get used to this so really good oh and by the way you guys I'm listening to crystal sounds you guys need to subscribe to crystal sounds they're on YouTube the music is is amazing these artists I don't even know where they're from but they need to continue doing what they're doing because I enjoy listening to them on Sundays and I was supposed to clean but that's okay my daughter's coming home <laughs> I can get her to help me clean but anyway um, I want to share with you guys I was talking about yesterday about Alexa I'm like you know, what's up with Alexa? Why we don't have an Alex? I'm thinking to myself, you know, why we don't have an Alex, right? And my sister friend was like, V, we don't need an Alex. You know, women rule the world. You know, let Alexa do her thing. True enough. You know, that's probably my married friends. But uh, for the single ladies, we need an Alex. You know, I want a British accent. You know, little thingy, echo dot to say, if I say... Alex, turn off the lights. Yes, baby. <laughs> I'm not even going to say Valencia. If you could say yes, baby. Yeah, I would need a man. <laughs> but it makes you wonder. It's like, okay, I, I've, been, I've been having this thing for, for the past nine months, and I have not. I've opened the, opened the box, but I haven't really. Okay, why am I lying? Because look. <laughs> Here's everything in here. Okay, I didn't open the box. But I was thinking this is probably some high-tech stuff that I probably wouldn't even understand. And I mean, I'm not a big techie person. But I just kind of thought it was a little creepy. But a lot of people say that it serves its purpose. You know, it des it's designed around your voice. Voice control music throughout your home. I mean, it, it actually reads stories to you. Like you can have it hooked up to your Kindle app or Spotify app or whatever. And it does everything for you. But what worries me about this is, do we really need technology like this? I kind of think that technology, as far as Alexa, I don't know. I think it has made us lazy. I don't think that people are, are serious about anything. No one wants to put in the work for anything. I didn't introduce technology to my daughter until she was in high school, until she was like 16. I don't know, it just seemed like it has made people lazy, it has made our children lazy. I mean, I'm not gonna sit up here and act like, oh, I don't use technology. You know, we all like convenience. But it has made us lose reality, the, the touch of, of a person. I don't know. I just feel like we're so disconnected. We are more demanding now. We're not more assertive to people's feelings. I think technology has changed the world, not for the better. And it scares me because it feels like we're in this Jetson type of world. You know, I wish that I could say, Alexa, pay my rent, <laughs> you know, if it was that easy. You know what I mean? If Alexa can do all these things, well then pay my rent. Or Alexa, when I go on a date, let me know if this is the right guy for me. You understand what I'm saying, people? I mean, please tell me, talk to me. Please leave a comment and tell me what you're feeling because 
I really truly believe that we are losing ourselves. And why? Why? Why would I want Alexa to read the newspaper for me or check weather? Okay, we'll check weather forecast, but I can look that up myself. But why do I really need that? It's almost like we're isolating ourselves. And I will admit, I, I have tend to become that way. I isolate, but I've always been a loner. I've always been kind of like to myself. But what is it? What is it that we need to do? Because this, this Alexa here is changing the world. I mean, we even have a Siri. If you have, if you're a um, iPhone user, you know, there's a Siri. I rarely ever use Siri. I think I only use Siri as if, like, I need to find something out at that moment, like, quickly. You know, uh, where do we go? Or, you know, where's such and such? You know, that's the only time I really use Siri. But I don't even like the fact that I can't remember phone numbers. There's got to be a change. I don't like how the way things are changing. I don't know, I just don't like it. You know, if that's the case, Alexa, you know, turn out all the power, put all the power out for work tomorrow because I sure in the hell don't feel like going to work. But you know what I mean, people? I want to know how, how many people have an Alexa. I mean, does it really serve a purpose? Does Alexa read your stories for you? Because I still, I still read books. It is difficult for me I have like two or three books that are downloaded on my iPad and I have not, I have not really sat down and actually read these, these stories. I, I can't even do it. I love holding a book. I have a bookshelf, you know, I don't know what I'm going to do because when I move, I have to carry all this stuff. I mean, it's, it is heavy, but I can't break away from it because I love holding a book. I'm old school. You know, I, I have a record player for Christ's sake, you know, why, you know, I want Alexa pay my bills, because if it's that easy, if it's really that easy, then there's something wrong, because if it's easy, then you're never going to work for anything, I just feel like life has gotten too easy, and I even feel, feel that even relationships, people don't work they don't really work hard to hold on to relationships. I, I can speak on that because I've experienced it. Um, I've been married. You have to really be selfless to be married. I think technology has made it easy for people to cheat. You know what I would like for Alexa to be a private investigator and be like, uh, um, Alexa, where is my man right now? <laughs> now that, that would serve a purpose for women. Now, that's not a bad idea because if anybody wants to start something like this, start a, a, a technology of Alexa uh, cheating bot, you know, that would serve a purpose. Even for men too. <laughs> but I feel like no one works, works together in a relationship. I feel like Technology has taught us not to be able to communicate and to open up our feelings. You know, it's always who's going to make the first move. I, I, I'm sorry, but, you know, I probably will be single for the rest of my life, but I refuse to chase. My brother has always told me that if a man doesn't come to you, he doesn't want you. If he can get it that easily, if he can come directly to you and say anything to you and woo you, and get you just like that without having to chase you a little bit. And just because a woman says chase doesn't mean I want you to run after me. I want you to kiss my ass. Nothing like that. Is that a woman wants you to see them. They want you to see what you're, what you're getting yourself into. It's more for you. Are you sure you want to get into this woman? Do you really want to meet this woman? Do you really want to have a relationship with her? Because she can be crazy. I know I'm crazy at times. I'm not that difficult, but I expect that person to really get to know me. And now that technology's here, men are like, shit, I, I got A, B, C, D, and E. Well, A ain't tripping. You know, she tripping. A is okay, but B, she tripping. I'm going to put her to the back. I mean, it's almost like, like a game of charades or something. I don't know. Or bingo, you know? 
it's like relationships now are like a game. So yeah, I probably will be solo. But yeah, I do believe that Alexa play, plays a big part in, in life changes and I, I don't like it. I mean, what do you guys think? I wanna hear your, your comments on what you think. And please, you know, if you have anything to talk about or anything that you would like to hear, you know, leave a little message. Please comment, that really helps. And also subscribe to my channel, okay? And invite your friends and family. Tell me what you like to hear. And um, yes, I will be drinking coffee the next time you see me. So you guys have a beautiful day. And don't let Alexa run things. You know, don't let her run your life. But today I'm going to be posting a whole bunch about Alexa. I'm just going to be, Alexa, <laughs> you know, pay my bills. Alexa, <laughs> am I going to hook this up? Am I going to use this? I don't know. I haven't decided whether or not I want to. Maybe I'll sell it. Maybe I'll give it away. I don't know, something to think about. I know I'm kind of crazy. Like, why would you not use it? But I don't know. I, I don't want to, I want to live and I want to be able to pick up the phone and call someone. I can turn my own TV on. I can, you know, play music. I don't think Alexa can turn the record player on. So, so yeah, you guys, you know, um, think about what I have to say and don't let these Alexas take over everything. You never know what's in those little echo dots, you know, because everybody's watching and following you. You just never know. So, you guys have a beautiful day. And if you have any questions, you know what to do. Hit that subscribe button. And, um, you know, thank you for spending the time with me. So have a good one, you guys. Bye-bye.